I am Tamisha Jones. I'm an assistant professor in the STEM education department. My research focuses on identifying ways that kids show their knowledge and creating tools that capture that so that we can prove that kids are brilliant and not using only standardized tests. Kids' imagination and their creativity is the best. So if you introduce engineering concepts and learning in the K-12 space, then you keep them thinking creatively. And you show them that out of the box thinking has a purpose and they believe that they can solve problems. I think if educators would show kids engineering where they live and what they use, their bicycle, their tablet, then engineering becomes less abstract and students will ask questions and when they ask questions they'll seek answers. So educators can make engineering less invisible. They can break down stereotypes about what engineering is, who can be an engineer. Lots of attention is given to technology as if it's the only way or the best way to introduce engineering concepts. But going low tech is actually more accessible. Educators can use recycled materials, create a list of things that you want and then have the students bring it in. Um, keep a junk treasure box in your class, find popsicle sticks, rubber band, string, thread spools. At the heart of engineering is problem solving. And even if a student doesn't go into engineering, they're going to have problems that they need to solve. So the courses that they take and the skills that they learn in the courses can give them habits of mind and teach them things that they can use for the rest of their life. 